morning, Sagittarius. Okay. How are you doing? <laughs> um, I hope you're doing well. Let's see what's going on with your bad selves. Let us find out. Let's see what your current energy is. The energy is around you. What's coming towards you? What's going away from you? Let's find out. Okay, so I see two contradicting energies here. We have Syrians A, artistic, integrity, and honesty. And then we have reptilians, predator, tyrannical, and survivalist. We have the empath and the narcissist. The tale is old as time, right? But, all right, so let's get to the nitty gritty. I'm going to clarify both. Alright. So, let's clarify Syrians A. So we have the death card in reverse, so it's like you're going through rebirth, right? Like something had to come to completion here, a cycle had to end so that you could enter your rebirth stage, right? Then reptilians. Put your energy where it belongs. I'm reading from the perspective of the Syrians A, so just letting you know. You know, you could be the reptilian. I don't want to think that. <laughs> um, I actually don't feel that. Because it was like, it came out as soon as I said, what is the energy um, that you're running away from? And then this showed up. And then with the death card in reverse, it kind of tells me that there's a cycle here ending. It could be a boss. could be like you leaving a job situation. could be a relationship thing. could be a friend thing. could be a family thing. We'll find out. Let's clarify the reptilian. chariot in reverse so they're not moving or there's no movement in their life they're not changing they're not developing um here one second i'll be right all right i had to turn on my heater i was getting cold the ghosts were coming out okay so the chariot in reverse that could also be a really imbalanced cancer right because the chariot is the cancer card so Let's find out. Let's find out. So, let's dive deeper. Let's talk about this death card in reverse. You know, I want to put some distance between you guys. I just feel that. I don't normally feel that, but. Like, I'm going to need to put some distance between you guys. Even if it's just on the board, I'm like, uh, let's, let's do this. Let's put a little rock there. <laughs> and it says strength, right? Because you're going to need the strength. Um, 
you know what you're gonna need some protection as well right strength and protection all right got you all right we're putting a whole rock wall divide between you guys All right, so let's clarify this death card in reverse. Let's talk about your rebirth. Let's talk about what's going on with that. This is really interesting energy. Um, you might have Capricorn in your chart, otherwise you might be dealing with the situation. Okay, so we have the Emperor. This is somebody who's very mature, who stands in their own power, who has a lot of integrity, who is very honest, who is very good, very forthright. Um, basically, think Marcus Aurelius. That's who the Emperor is, right? I feel like you have been kind of under the control of the devil here, right? Like, the devil has been a big part of your life. We come back to that narcissist empath, empath situation, right? They left you feeling trapped, right? And the interesting thing about this trapped feeling here, though, is that, like, her feet are not bound. She could easily walk up to one of those swords, unbind herself, and take the blindfold off. But it's almost like she doesn't want to see what she's really dealing with here. You know, she doesn't want to see the energy here. Um, she doesn't want to see that she's really fucking trapped by the devil. And that the person, you know, I'm going to find out your, your connection with the chariot in reverse. I get the instinct, intuition that you guys probably live together. Um... Let's see. Like they're not moving. They're not doing anything. And that leaves you in that Eight of Swords energy. That like. Fuck. Energy. You know like that's all I can hear in my mind is fuck. And the thing is, is this devil is keeping you kind of like, I see these two lovers at the bottom, right? And they're chained up and they're separated and the devil just kind of stands between them, you know? And it's kind of like, fucked up. It's kind of fucked up. And the devil is somebody who weaves lies illusion, manipulates, controls, wants to have the final say in fucking everything, thinks that they're higher than everyone else. Hell, they probably are high on fucking crack, thinking they could do this to you, right? Thinking they could put you through that shit. Alright, so, let's talk about this chariot in reverse. could be an imbalanced cancer sign. the judgment card the divine is calling judgment on this you see that angel up there fucking blowing that trumpet yeah this little fucker thought he was in charge this 
this fool is coming out of the fucking clouds like, who the fuck do you think you are? <laughs> like, oh fuck. They getting judgment on the ass. They're getting hella bad karma right now. And they earned it. They absolutely earned it. Every ounce of bad karma they get, they earned it. Um, fuck. That's like all that came out. It's like, oh yeah, they're not moving forward in life. They're not, they, they're not progressing to the next level because judgment is being called on the ass. <laughs> oh man. That's like, that's pretty much all we need to know about that situation, right? Okay. All right. So, you know what? I'm going to put the devil over here. Because I really want to keep that divide between you, right? I don't, I don't, I don't like the energy of that. I don't even like this trapped energy. But you know what? I see you coming out of it. I see you coming out of it and standing your authority. I see you doing just fine. <laughs> uh, but that little devil... They gonna be fucked. <laughs> you know, this kind of reminds me of the last reading that I had for you. Um, maybe this is somebody that you do this back and forth with, right? Maybe this is somebody that you struggle to let go of, like that karmic relationship. Dude, you want to get out of that house before it catches fire, okay? <laughs> and I mean metaphorical fire. When the divine calls judgment on a situation, you do not want to fucking be there. You know, I mean, right now it's on your behalf, but it's like if you continue to stay under their fucking reign, if you continue to stay under in their fucking prison, dude, that's just gonna, it could potentially be bad for you, okay? So it's like saying, get out now. It's like, I, I keep thinking of Sodom and Good, Gomorrah, right? When the angel tells Lot's wife, do not look back. Don't you fucking look back, <laughs> you know? Just keep going. Do not even glance back. And she's like, but my friends. <laughs> and she looks back and bam, pillar of salt, right? That's all she became, a pillar of salt. So, yeah, I just... I think I think on that shit, and it's like, dude, you don't want to fucking be there. You don't want to be around this energy. You don't want to participate with it. You don't want to entertain it at all. Like, you need to cut fucking ties. Alright, so, what's future energy for Sagittarius? here this is like feeling at a crossroads like trying to choose a new direction right you can go forward or you can go backwards and i do not ever fucking re recommend going backwards at all wheel of fortune good fortune is in your favor right things will be changing you need to choose that right you need to choose that choose new direction choose your new path right now you could what do you want to do? What do you want to be? Where do you want to go? That's what you need to be focused on. Not this devil, right? We already know what's coming down on the devil. They're not progressing in life. They're not moving forward. They're not changing. So, love yourself. Respect yourself enough to set down that wand. See how that wand's behind him? See how it's behind him? He ain't touching that wand. He ain't even looking back at it. He's grabbed his, and he's like, all right, we're going forward. I'm not going back. In fact, he's got a globe in his hand. He has a globe in his hand. He's looking at the globe like, all right, where in the world am I going? Right? Where in the world am I going? That's what you need to focus on. Where in the world are you going? 
Look, there's angels overseeing that. There's an angel up there. There's a fucking bird. <laughs> I want to say a phoenix, but that's not right. Um, you know, like, we've got a fucking little baby pegasus down here. A lion with wings. Come on. There's so much wings in this. Um, there's so much shit. And it's like, you just... Just need to push forward. Just need to release it. Allow good fortune to befall upon you. <laughs> to befall you? Whatever. To be bestowed upon you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Like, it's time to release all that old shit. All that bad shit. Just wish them well. Hell, even say a prayer for them while you're out the fucking door. Say a fucking prayer for them. They're gonna fucking need it. <laughs> don't wish them, don't wish bad on them. You know, because that's part of it. You know, what you wish on other people comes back on you. So you want to only wish goodness. Understand that they're getting their karma with or without your prayers. Because they earned it. They put themselves in that situation. Alright, so what else does... The universe spirit want to tell Sagittarius. Seven of Swords in Reverse, you could put all your fucking swords down because the Divine is fighting in your favor now. Your ancestors are. Yeah, King of Swords in Reverse, you can put all your swords down. You don't need to feel guarded anymore. You don't need to feel... You don't need to be on edge. You don't need to fight. You don't need to be like... You don't need to say shit. Walk away. Walk in a new direction. Find a new direction. A new path. Um, just say sayonara. Say la vie. Um, I'm going to pull some oracle cards for you. See if there's any advice or reassurance that we could find in this, in this deck. Yeah, your ego doesn't need to fight this battle, bro. Throw the ego away. Because right now, your ancestors, your angels, God, everyone's fighting for you right now. Put all your fucking swords down and know that you are protected. No weapon formed against you in spirit or physical shall prosper, right? You are divinely favored, protected from all evil. This is a prayer that, um, JDS Tarot, he often says, and I fucking love that, and that's one of the reasons that I'm kind of, like, saying it to you now, because I feel like you really need to understand, when you have your guardians on the case, you don't need to fight anymore. You are protected. You are safe from all harm. They can't fucking touch you. All you have to do is walk away. And you should check out JDS Tarot. It's fucking awesome. And he's like this school older dude. Always smoking cigarettes. Really sassy. I love that guy. <laughs> um, yes, I do watch Tarot as well. Obviously, I love Tarot. I could, I could sh give you a whole fucking rundown about some of my fa favorite uh, Tarot readers. That's one cool thing about being a tarot reader is I don't feel like there's any competition. I feel like there's worth in every message you can get from us. Like, no matter what the source, you're getting good messages. It's all coming from the divine. There's no competition here. There's room for all of us. Okay. So, this kind of came out on this side. 
So we're going to read it like I saw it. Okay? So we have wild at heart. And it's kind of saying, you know, follow your heart. Allow your nature to kind of come out. See, she's like playing music. She's just, like the birds are dancing in the back. It's just good fucking vibes, right? She's sitting on her broomstick. She's flying. Okay? And then with oaken doors in the reverse, it's... I, I, like it came out on this side under your reptilian devil and it's like saying this is their last battle that they get to fight with you right this is the last piece of bullshit as soon as you walk away and you let the fucking universe do what the universe is gonna do with them they're done they're done for they're done they're not gonna endure that one it's gonna every time they try to come at you they're gonna get Hit again. Hit again. The universe is giving it give them the good old one too. You know? <laughs> like da 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 That's what's happening. I don't know, sorry. But yeah. This is spiritual warfare, bro. This is what it looks like. It comes in the shape of people you fucking care about. And that's the hardest part about it. Is that it it comes in the shape of the people that you don't want to let go of. The people that you don't want to release. But it's like... That's why it's the hardest one, you know? That's why it takes the strongest kind of person to go through spiritual warfare like this. I'm going to see if there's any last messages for you before we close out this circle. to catch it it like flew across her um so we have taking to heart all right what i see here is like it's saying follow your heart right and she's sitting there just like following that little guy just enjoying it it's just an awe look at all these sunflowers it's just a really fucking good card and yeah dude i just see you kind of like following your heart following your instincts, following your intuition, um, listen to your heart, it's like that song, listen to your heart, when he's calling for you, it's talking about God, I'm sure, <laughs> um, but yeah, listen to your heart right now, listen to your intuition, I feel like there's a lot of wisdom in that, don't be afraid to get in touch with your inner child and enjoy life again, you know? You've been such a fucking grown-up lately. Stop that. <laughs> Jeez, what are you trying to do? Your mother doesn't want to see this side of you. Stop trying to be such a grown-up. <laughs> I know, I'm over here being fucking Peter Pan. But, honestly, it's the way to live. <laughs> it's great. It's fun. Go have a food fight or something, <laughs> you know? Um... Learn how to enjoy life again, bro. That's pretty much what I got for you. Namaste. I love you all, and I'll catch you on the next one.